Hello you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I am showing you around Disney's Copper Creek Villas at the Wilderness Lodge. This is a deluxe studio with a bathtub because there are two different studio room categories at Copper Creek. You have the walk-in shower and the bathtub. So this is the deluxe studio with a bathtub. <laughs> I'm very excited to show you guys around, so let's get started. All right, we are in room 1136. This is our deluxe studio at Copper Creek Villas. Right when you walk in is your closet. So extra pillow and blanket, hangers, safe, iron and ironing board, and then lots of space if you want to store your luggage in here. There is extra storage for that. So very nice. And then coming over to the kitchenette, this is the main perk of staying in the villas at Copper Creek is this right here. So this pulls out and you have a lot of storage here. So great if you are staying for an extended period of time and you have groceries and you kind of want to unpack and settle in a little bit more. I love that there's so much storage and then utensils, can opener, dish towel in here is an extra trash can and paper towels, more dish soap, dish towel, more storage. And then an extra sink, which is always nice. Up above here is your ice bucket with plastic bowls, plates, cups, and lids if you are like my husband and you need your coffee to go every morning. <laughs> and then up here is your toaster. So that's where you can find that. Your microwave, of course, coffee pot, and all of your coffee essentials right here. And you do have some extra lighting as well. And then this is an actual refrigerator, which is very, very nice. I don't believe this one has a freezer section. So it looks like this is just a refrigerator, but your dairy products will be good to go in this. <laughs> so that is very nice to have a little bit of an upgrade from the beverage cooler. So turning around, let me scoot back a little bit. So you do have a full length mirror, like giant full length mirror right here. And then this does slide, you have that sliding barn door style to the bathroom. So coming on in is your sink and vanity. Again, lots of storage. I love the counter space up here. You have your mirror that's nice and lit. And then I like that they have actual drawers, your blow dryer, another trash can in here, but again, more storage back in there. And then lots of storage under here as well, which I really love. I feel like a lot of the Disney resorts don't have a ton of storage in the bathrooms. Like it's rare to find. So when you see these little cubbies that are actually pretty deep, I mean, you could fit your full toiletry bag in there. It's really, really nice. Again, another empty drawer. Very nice, your H2O products. So love this bathroom. And then this is the deluxe studio with the bathtub. So very nice. I love the upgraded glass door right in here. And you have a rainfall shower head, which is very fancy. And then of course, all of your H2O products, but very nice. I intentionally booked a deluxe studio that had a bathtub as compared to the walk-in shower, just for the sake of having my preschooler here. It makes bath time way easier when you have an actual bathtub and you're not having to make do with a walk-in shower. So very nice, love the bathroom setup. And then this does, oops, this does close off as well. So what we've done in the past is we leave this cracked and we will put a pack and play right in here and we still can squeeze through right here <laughs> to get to the shower and the toilet at night. And then we would put our toddler in a pack and play and close this off. So that is an option. I do like that setup when you have the option to kind of separate spaces is really nice. Coming around to the main bedroom, you have a lovely table and chair set here 
with some outlets and a nice little mirror right here with a fun light fixture. And then again, tons of storage right here with this dresser. So you could do some serious unpacking here and I just love that there is so much extra storage options here. And then of course right here would be the adjoining room if you had a one bedroom lock off um, that had an additional bedroom to make it a two bedroom if that makes sense. So we won't be utilizing that door but that is what that door is connected to. And then of course more outlets right up here. So lots of space to charge all of the things. And then coming around here is your queen bed. And I need to check this out. This is the first time that I've ever seen a Disney Resort room have this little Mickey, like almost Alexa kind of device. So I'm very interested to kind of play around with that and see some of the features and kind of check that out. But again, more storage, like it just keeps going and more outlets. You have a USB port right here as well. And then I like that these lights are actually on a dimmer. So very nice when you are winding down for bed or you just need a little bit of light while your kids are trying to go to sleep and you need just, just something. So you're not in the pitch black. <laughs> so that is very nice. And then Ellie, <laughs> very tired from our travel day this morning, but Again, same thing over here, more outlets and another USB port right here, more storage. And then this does pull out to a queen sized bed. So this is where Ellie will be sleeping. So I'm gonna pull that out and we can get it all set up with the bedding. And then this coffee table right here, let me see if I can pull this up. You have, again, more storage, like it just keeps going. But if you needed to get some work done or you wanted to bring your lunch or dinner back to the room, this is really, really great as kind of a makeshift table or desk or whatever you need it to be. And then of course you have all the storage underneath. Stepping outside to our patio, we are on the ground floor, which is technically the first floor, but we had to go down a level from the lobby, which is technically the second floor, if that makes sense. So we are on the ground floor, which means we get this nice little patio area out here and you have your table and chairs. And then I guess we could really just walk on out. I mean, you could step right off your patio and Geyser Point is right there. So we could just walk right through the grass and head straight to Geyser Point from here. So that's really nice. So that is kind of the one perk of being on this ground floor. Um, you know, to get back up to the lobby, we do have to go back up on the elevator, but nice little patio right here and it does connect. So that is kind of strange because over there is the one bedroom villa that would connect this to make it a two bedroom lock off. So I think that's why this is connected, but also something to be aware of if you have one of those studios that have that lock off is that you are sharing this open space here. So I don't know how I feel about that, but 1136, that's what we got. So very nice, lovely, little resort woods view here, very wilderness-y. All right, well that wraps it up for today's room tour. I hope you enjoyed getting a peek into the deluxe studios here at Copper Creek at Wilderness Lodge. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure that you are subscribed to catch more Disney content from this trip and give this video a thumbs up if you found this helpful. Thank you guys again for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.